Victoria has just recorded its 10th day in a row with zero COVID cases as the state ramps up police patrols on the New South Wales border. Today, Melbourne reporter Isabella Stashkowski is at Melbourne Airport. Isa, good morning. A hard border has still not been ruled out. Yeah, that's certainly right, Charles. Good morning. And when you consider the vastly different scenarios in each state at the moment, it really could be imposed at any point. It would cause a number of issues, especially for those border communities. But I can tell you that a number of Victorians are actually calling for a hard border. Now, here at the airport this morning, as you can see, things are looking pretty much as normal as they can be. It has been quite busy this morning and it will continue to be because our travel uh, restrictions are going to be easing further from 11.59 tonight, WA, the NT and parts of Queensland will become green zones for Victorians, while parts of uh, Queensland like Brisbane, which were previously red zones, will become orange zones. So if Victorians go there when they come home, they just need to go and get a test and isolate till that negative result. Of course, it is a very developing situation and Victorian authorities are watching the situation in New South Wales very closely. There are border patrols right now, police officers checking everyone coming into the state via road and ensuring that they're not people coming from those red zones in New South Wales.